There were concerns last year over the use of antibiotic eye drops called chlorophenicol for conjunctivitis in children under the age of 2. These drops contain a buffering agent called boric acid which was thought to affect future fertility for both male and female and this was banned for children between the ages of 0 to 2. This however does not apply to the chlorophenicol eye ointment which does not contain boric acid. Boric acid is also found in eye wash solutions. It has both antifungal and antibacterial properties. It soothes the eye if irritated or you get that burning sensation and it helps to buffer the pH if it's acidic or alkaline, making it more comfortable for the drops to be used on the eyes. For children under the age of 2, the maximum amount of boric acid in the solution should not exceed 1 mg a day. As we know, chlorophenicol eye drops are applied between 3 to 4 times a day for a period of 5 to 10 days. Further studies and evidence have since shown that the concentration of boric acid in antibiotic eye drops, even using this frequency of drops, are still way below the 1 mg a day safety limit to cause any issues and the ban was lifted. Chlorophenicol eye drops are now deemed safe to use, but you have to remember that 80% of conjunctivitis infections are actually viral and they usually resolve by themselves within 5 to 10 days just by simple eye hygiene, cleaning your eyes of cool board water, using diluted baby shampoo, or if you're breastfeeding, the, your breast milk actually has antibacterial and antifungal properties as well. It has been shown that chronic exposure of chlorophenicol eye drops, especially if you're using it for too long and unnecessarily, can affect the can cause toxicity of the bone marrow and cause a rare condition called aplastic anemia. This is basically where the bone marrow is not able to produce enough red blood cells and can lead to fatigue, dizziness, headaches, bruising, uncontrolled bleeding and many other symptoms. So if you're going to use chlorophenicol eye drops for conjunctivitis, you have to think, is this viral or bacterial? And I would advise you to speak to your doctor before going over the counter to use antibiotic eye drops for your child. However, as we've mentioned, chlorophenicol eye drops are now deemed as safe to use in children under the age of two. So if you like this video, please feel free to subscribe to my channel.